Welcome to Centennial High School, home of the FCCLA Hawks. Hello, everyone. I'm Mrs. Romig, and next to me pictured is Mrs. Salmon. We would love for you to join our FCCLA family. We provide students with opportunities to develop leadership and employability skills. We run a food service business to help fundraise for our organization expenses. You can see pictured in this graphic, it's our cafe. We actually call it the early bird cafe because we're open in the morning before school to service our students on campus with beverages, pastries, breakfast burritos, you name it. So this cafe helps fund all of our community service projects events that our students plan in addition to paving the way for them to go to our state conference and national conference. So it helps them out financially. Hi, future FCCLA friends. I'm Zayek, a junior at Centennial High School and FCCLA's chapter president. I'm looking forward to sharing a bit of what FCCLA is and what it stands for. And hopefully you get to know why I love this organization and I'm proud to be a part of it. Hi, I'm Kirsten, a senior at Centennial and FCCLA chapter vice president. FCCLA is all about promoting personal growth and leadership development. Hi, I'm Kazan, an 11th grader at Centennial High School, and I'm one of the four officers that stand alongside Thayek and Kirsten, each with our role and responsibility to make sure FCCLA members are career prepared, help the community, become leaders, and that, and that members be, we become a family. So these lovely ladies actually run all the meetings alongside Hilaria, our chapter secretary, Maddie, our vice president of finance, and Jordan, our public relations officer who runs our social media. FCCLA is a student-run organization, even at the national level. There's the national officers, which are high school students, and there are the state officers, which are also high school students and even middle school students. We are fortunate to have these ladies running our chapter this year. So one of the many highlights of our organization is STAR events. So this is where students develop a project that is important to them, and they take that project and go and compete with it. We have the opportunity to compete at the local and national level, and that has given a lot of opportunities for students to develop career readiness skills, develop just personally and grow as a person. And so some of the different projects that are available um, there is actually something for everyone, but under human services, one of the examples might be chapter service display. Hospitality and tourism, we have an entrepreneurship project. We also have a culinary team that often competes at the local and national level. Um, and then we also have a pastry competition that can be part of that umbrella. Then we have education and training. So focus on children. Anyone who is looking to work with children someday can actually do a project and go and compete with it about children. Then we have visual arts and design. One of the examples might be repurpose and redesign, and then plenty of opportunities to develop real life skills, but one of the examples is job interview. These competitive events are prepared by students and they take them with those with their projects, presentations, and displays, whatever the event may entail, to our local district competition, state competition, and if they place in the top two at the state competition, they get to advance to the national competition. So this year's national theme, you can see here on the slide, is Beyond Measure for 2021. Also, a big part of FCCLA at the national level are the national programs. You can see them pictured here. Career Connection, FACTS, Families First, Financial Fitness, Leadership Service in Action, Power of One, Stop the Violence, and Student Body. These national programs provide students the opportunity to develop meaningful projects that affect themselves and their community in, in extremely amazing ways. Also, we have our pathways. So real world skills through family consumer science education, just as Ms. Romig mentioned a few of the sample projects before, we focus heavily on these four pathways, human services, hospitality and tourism, education and training, and visual arts and design. We invite you to grab a pencil and a paper and follow along as we draw a clear picture of what FCCLA is for you. F. The letter F stands for family. 
FCCLA focuses on family because our sense of the word family and the values we place on the word are the key components that factor into making leaders. Our club is a family. I'm going to ask you guys to draw a lowercase letter F at the far side of your paper. Make this into a heart, like so. Now think about who in your family has helped you grow and develop as a person. Write their names within the heart. We help students think about how each of our home relationships shape our leadership voices. C. The first C in FCCLA stands for career. FCCLA helps students in their future careers by building strong leadership qualities in them and exposing them to opportunities in their selected pathways. So for this letter, draw a box like letter C next to the F on your paper. Make this into a briefcase like so. Think about what career you would like to pursue. What is your dream? Write it within the briefcase. Now, take a moment to reflect. Is that one of the mentioned FCCLA pathways? We help students think about what career they would like to follow and guide them to opportunities to grow and even compete in events meant to strengthen the skills needed for this career choice. C. The letter C stands for community. FCCLA has the word community in it because we understand that leaders are built through the impact they make in their communities. On your paper, draw a round letter C next to the previous C. Make this into community members. Think about what communities you're a part of. Write three communities that you're a part of within the shirts of your drawing. We help students reflect upon how many of these communities they are being active and positively impacting members in. We do many community service projects. So community service for our organization is one of the many highlights that we have. Um, we value all the different opportunities that we create to go help other people and just work on different activities and leadership development um, within our community just to reach out and help those in need. Some of the examples of our community service projects that we have done are pictured here in the letter C. At the very top, that's a picture from last year when we got to serve at the Bobby Socks and Lollipops Dinner for Care Las Cruces. We also pictured on the left part of the C where we're, the students are polishing silverware. Every year we take delight and we are so excited to participate in the Salvation Army's Dress a Child Dinner to raise funds for our local community members and their families to help buy clothes for those in need. We have, these are just a few of the many community service projects that we do. L, the letter L stands for leaders. The word leader in FCCLA is arguably the word that most signifies what FCCLA is. We are le leaders, we build leaders. So draw an uppercase letter L after the previous letter and make this into a leader's blazer. Think about what aspects of your leadership you would like to develop or even grow in. Write those next to the blazer as a symbol of your leadership journey. We help students find their leadership voices and develop real life skills that will shape them into the leaders they were made to be. A, the letter A stands for America. FCCLA has the word America in it because we impact our countries by spreading awareness of world issues and needs and by creating young aspiring leaders who will lead their communities and make the world a better place. Draw an uppercase letter A at the far side of your paper. Make this into a liberty path. Think about what American values you hold dear. What precious values help you look forward towards the future with high hopes? Write those below the back. We help students form an understanding and appreciation for the precious value that America holds and preserves, such as liberty, justice, equality, and diversity. By the end of this video, your paper should have FCCLA written on it, as should your future. We turned the F into a heart to remind us of the word family in FCCLA. We turned the C into a briefcase to hold our dream and remind us of the word career in FCCLA. We turned the second C 
into a smiling community to represent the communities we form a positive part of. We turned the L into a blazer and wrote an aspect of our leadership journeys we can work on to remind us of the word leaders in FCCLA. And lastly, we turned the letter A into the Liberty Bell to remind us of the word America in FCCLA. We invite you to join FCCLA. Thank you so much for watching and I hope that you will come and um, see what our club is all about. Like I said, there's a place for everyone to be a part of something. And again, just um, as new Centennial students, we would love for you to come and check out our organization. Yes, there's a lot of value. Mrs. Romig and I both can attest that this organization is just a huge part of the high school experience for us as your advisors. And we look forward to meeting you and to developing you into the leader that you're meant to be. And so please look into our organization as a great fit for you. We have our contact information right here. Both of our emails are listed on here as well. We do have an FCCLA Instagram, which you're more than welcome to uh, check out as well. It's actually FCCLA Hawks underscore Centennial. Please like and subscribe this video and check us out and contact us for more information. Thank you, everybody. Bye, future FCCLA Hawks.